food prep and what I do on Mondays. Uh, I told you all that um, I season all my food and soak all of it on Sunday and uh, kind of dethaw it. And so actually on Mondays, I'm going to uh, actually prepare the, prepare the food and I'm going to show you what I do. Um, I'll just show you my two main kind of food groups that I eat during the week. Uh, the first one is just chicken breast um, or chicken cuts, I'm sorry. It's actually 99% uh, fat free. I don't know if you can see much of this, but this is the uh, turkey breast cut. My chicken breast, uh, this is two pounds of chicken breast. These are all very large chicken breasts. And my favorite seasoning is <clears throat> this lemon pepper seasoning. I actually thawed the chicken breast though before I uh, season it and then I poke some holes actually in the chicken breast and then um, I throw the chicken breast in the container overnight and let that sit in there. Uh, like I said, this is only about two pounds of chicken and then another pound and a half of this turkey breast and this is what I'll uh, prepare tonight and then also um, I have all my fish for the week which is about another I don't know, probably like three pounds, I guess, of fish. I just eat. Uh, here's how big these guys are. So, uh, that is swai fish. It's a white fish. Um, it's kind of like tilapia, but it's a little bit bigger um, fillet, so that's why I like that. And those, I don't cook my fish beforehand because I really think uh, fish warmed up is pretty disgusting. All right, what's up? I uh, just got all my uh, chicken and turkey uh, cut up. So uh, now I'm gonna show you how I prepare it. Um, I will show you. Here is my chicken. I cut them all up into fairly small strips. Uh, helps with cooking faster and honestly it makes it easier for my meals. And then my turkey, I cut all that up too in about the same size strips. So, not really strips, I guess, more like chunks. Um, it actually helps with cooking, it cooks faster, and uh, yeah, it helps me honestly when I eat because I can take exactly how much I uh, want to eat. And this is what the pans that I use, I know they're uh, not the nicest ever, but they're just stainless pans. 100% extra, ver extra virgin olive oil. Put a little bit of that in there. Also in here. Boom. Boom. And honestly, just take this entire Throw the lid on, bada bing, bada boom. Same thing with your turkey. Yeah, this is gonna be really tough to do. <laughs> Take the lid on real quick and get at it. All right, boys and girls, this is what we're dealing with. Oh yeah, look at that turkey. Mm-hmm, looks so good. Little lemon pepper chicken cut up, oh yeah. About halfway through, so probably another five to 10 minutes, we'll be good to go. Stay tuned, yeah, but. Okay guys, I think, I think, I think, at least my turkey, it is done and cooked. Um, I don't know the best way that you guys um, check it, but here's the simplest way that I found. Uh, take the absolute biggest piece that um, you have in your pan and then just cut it in half. And then if it um, is cooked all the way through, there's a good chance that the rest of your turkey or whatever you're cooking 
is also done too. And that one actually looks really done. Not really done, but it looks done enough. And uh, so I'm going to shut the turkey off. And I'm going to check the chicken right now. It would be normal for you guys. So with chicken, just cook it until there's no pink left. Uh, turkey, make sure it's just completely white. Um, you know, don't, it's, and especially if you're doing steak. If you're doing steak, uh, you know, say you like your steaks medium. Well, make sure that it's one shade of pink less than medium. So, me personally, I like my steaks well, so I would cook it until it was medium well. That way when you reheat it, because um, it's actually going to warm up another temperature. So, uh, that's just a quick little cooking meat. Alright, what up? Uh... Chicken is cooked, turkey is cooked, and here is the finished product. All of. Did I say that's my turkey? This is my chicken. An idiot. <laughs> and my turkey. Yeah. So that's it. That's how I prepare my food, guys. Uh, make sure you're doing it. Uh, that way you don't have any excuses when you are, uh, you know hungry or you're out and about or someone's like hey let's go out to eat you know it's easier to you know kind of turn those things down if you have a plan in place so make sure you're doing that all right guys thanks for watching i will see you next time